It's been a long day. Your head hits the pillow and you're out like a light. But inside your body, the work day has just begun. You see, when you sleep, red blood cells carry oxygen to the brain, organs, and body tissues, preparing all systems for go tomorrow. But if you snore often and loudly, it could be a sign that your airway is closing and your breathing is being continually inter inter interrupted, shutting off your uh, intake of oxygen. Snoring can be a symptom of a more serious condition called obstructive sleep apnea, or OSA, in which the upper airway collapses repeatedly during sleep, shutting off your air supply. Like a kink in a garden hose shuts off the flow of water, the result is that your breathing can stop for 10 seconds or more, literally dozens of times per hour or hundreds of times per night. This deprives your brain and body of the oxygen they need to restore themselves overnight. It also allows carbon dioxide to build up in the bloodstream, which causes painful morning headaches. This interrupted sleep pattern leads to waking up feeling exhausted, like you ran a marathon in your sleep, as well as irritability, difficulty concentrating, and uh, where was I? Oh yeah, daytime sleepiness. As blood oxygen levels drop, your brain and body go into survival mode, also known as fight or flight. Buckets of adrenaline are dumped into your system, raising your blood pressure and heart rate, causing your heart to beat more forcefully and rapidly. This is helpful when facing a woolly mammoth, but not so good when your body is supposed to be resting. Adrenaline also jumpstarts your inflammatory cell response and makes the blood more likely to clot. Again, good if you're wounded in a fight, but not good if you are sleeping. The risk of clotting and inflammation in the blood vessels makes heart disease and blocked arteries significantly more likely. Your body also floods with cortisol, a hormone which stimulates the appetite and increases blood sugar. Together with surging adrenaline, the sustained release of cortisol can lead to weight gain and diabetes. When this happens night after night, it increases your risk of a heart attack, stroke, or heart failure. It can also lead to decreased libido. Wait, what? Restful, uninterrupted sleep is vital to your health and the single most important factor in maintaining a healthy brain and body. In fact, studies now show that people with untreated sleep apnea are more likely to get dementia and Alzheimer's disease as they age. But when sleep apnea is detected and treated, you'll greatly improve your sleep breathing health and you'll feel better almost immediately. You'll be more alert, more productive, with more energy and an overall higher quality of life. The crucial first step is to understand your sleep breathing health and what it can tell you about the risks your body may be taking during sleep. Sweet dreams.